Hello, everybody. Welcome. Hold on. Okay. So I'm going to teach you the Rebo Pass. Rebo Pass is a really good thing. Play because if you play in the game, you can play. So it's not so off. But D4, um, you're taking um away the D5 and F5 squares. You're, you're going to play E5. And striking back in the center, we're just going to start playing standard. Knight F3, and then we're playing Knight C6. And here, the best move... I'm not the best move, but Bishop B5 starts with a reload pass. Also known as the spinal, or you can call the spinal stem. And there are two ground blues, mainly uh, the exchange. Uh, I don't know how, I, mean, I think I maybe know how the exchange goes, but you can go for it. But the two in this video is the Berlin and the Morphe. We're gonna start with the <clears throat> Berlin with which happens with knight to f6. Here we're just doing this so we can attack the pawn. I used to and here both moves are d3 or castles. I play d3 a lot. Like Technically, like, all the time when I play Rilo Pass. I play Rilo Pass maybe, like, uh, if I play games in a week, I probably play, like, 10 games for real. So I play a lot. So, yeah, um, D3, I used to play D3 a lot, but then I learned Castles is the best move. You can play D3, I'll show you what happens on D3. D3, the best move is this. Um, Bishop C5, and then we're going to castle, castles. And then rook one. And it's not that interesting because nothing really has happened. And you think your opponent's going to play this, but I mean, you can play this, but it's just opening up the file. We don't really care if you play this because you're still knight is not out. And your opponent's like, fine, okay, fine. You can play d4 and then take because your knight is not out, but your queen is in danger. Anyways, you can take this. I mean, you still have it, but you know, you can play this from pawn. Uh, there are many things you can play here, but I mean, uh, maybe d4 wasn't the best move, uh, but okay, h6 it's a pretty good move. h6 is pretty good. Um, I mean, you can, I mean, h6 is pretty good, and then you can play d4. And then after this, you, after you put this, you can, I mean, it. then you can play this, and then you maybe wait for a little bit, but you can't wait because you, you're just going to end up all the pieces, and there won't be enough pieces to, I mean, there will be enough, but it's just not enough to attack. So that's what happens if you play D3. The, um... But we can, the best move is castles. And you're thinking, well, why would, <clears throat> well, why would, it's the most common to play with the Berlin defense. Uh, but well, it's saying like, why would I, I it, choose to be pawn? Well, it isn't. Uh, because once you take this, I'm going to play really one. And here I've seen many people play um, this, uh, knight to f6, but the actual best is knight to d3, d6. Because sometimes people fall into it, they actually, um, they just lead the pawn and they actually uh, just take away the bishop and play here the bishop really good because actually, uh, because if you ask another variation that uh once uh when I was playing, they fell 
they end up losing badly, you could end up in a bad position. So that's why this bishop is important. And that's the thing with for the queen or the rook, pretty much here. It's so um now you can use the best move and once we take this, of course you might think, oh, I can take this. But okay. Um and then and you're like, okay, right this. Well, they'll think about it by not the best move while I give you a couple of seconds. Congratulations to the people who found it and the people who just want to enjoy the show. It is night tick C6. This completely personally, you're in check, your queen's in danger, just try to save it. Uh so you have to give away you have to give away your queen. Um or you can play bishop there. Doesn't matter. And you lost there. So this is the move. Um that's why. You don't capture the bishop, instead you capture this, and then we capture it, and this with this, of course, and then we just start moving up, and then uh, sometimes you can play this, and then you cannot play this, so might as well just go back here, um, and then uh, you castle maybe, I play d4, I play the rook one, I can maybe get my queen into the game. There's many things could have happened, but this is the main thing. Um, well, what happens if they don't actually capture and they actually take bishop c5? Well, if I've played this many times, you actually play rook. They're two good moves. Uh, well, let me calculate this. This is a good move because you will have center for you will give away a pawn, but you could play with me one. No, 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 wait. They're actually. I'm not sure what wait, let's actually do a service. Oh, why? Oh, I see. Because I've I've played this position and do uh do you know why? I've actually posted this in another video I did. Um, but actually, um, if you play like this, 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 we're gonna have this, 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 and we get into this. So yeah. So yeah. Um, so after castles, um, what if they play bishop c5, like I said? Um, yeah, you could take or you could play rook e1. Uh, both moves are good, but rook e1, I mean, it's a good move. But if castles king side, and now we play this. Now, if you play, here is the, and if you play rook e1, and then you can do, oh, nice. And then here, and then if you find, um, uh, if you, and then if you like play, uh, let's say I'm just gonna play a random move, uh, this, this, because, no, not this yet, um, yeah, this, h3, and then we're playing the, this to take this. This is the worst move in the world. Feel free to pause the video and find out the best move while 
uh, while I give you a couple of seconds. Let's take a fan page of Well, congratulations to the people who found me and the people who want to enjoy the show. The move is D4. Here, the game is lost because if you take the position, like I said, you can take here, takes, and I mean, the black is up. But once we play this, we'll see about that. Because uh, if you take, we're going to go direct on that. If you let him take, if you take with the queen, we're gonna have some serious problems. In the same way, we can take with this. So, well, of course, we have to go for this one. Uh, but I mean, d4 is a pretty good move. Uh, they say, but what happens if you take the How do you defend this? What? Is d4 the best move? Or let me see. Oh. It's actually moved to A4. Oh, uh, but anyways, D4 is a good move. Uh, I mean, D4 and A5. A4 is pretty good. Uh, uh, but D4 is also good because you are expecting a second you take with this. Uh, let's see, actually see the best one. Comes. Oh, like I was saying, you take this. And, of course, you need to take back. And of course, the of course, take the free pawn, and then you take takes maybe. Um, and yeah, it's semi good position. So, there are many ways to play Berlin, uh, but these are like main lines to play the Berlin. Um, and um, it, yeah, so. Uh, the real is, is complicating, uh, but I mostly memorized the uh, uh, Berlin and Murphy. Murphy, um, so yeah, oh yeah, so that's the Berlin. Um, uh, we could spend a little more time on the Murphy, but those are main lines for Murphy and uh. Uh, so yeah, thank you for watching and have a great success.